What's going on YouTube? It's Bear, and today I'm bringing you another tutorial, and this is going to be how to do a displacement effect. It's also known as displacement mapping. What this basically does is it glitches out your banner for you in a very easy way, and uh, instead of doing it by hand. So the final product is going to be uh, something like that. As you see, it just like glitches apart, and uh, I'll be teaching you how to make your own displacement, like displacement on PSDs. Also, in the description, there will be a pack of the images I use and also the PSDs. So if you want to go ahead and download that and just skip to the end of the video. But for the people that want to do it themselves, uh, the first thing I want to do is download the pack in the description anyway. And there's going to be four images, and you can use any four images you'd like. But uh, there's like images like this, that, this, and of course this. So it's pretty much just like water and like ripples and then uh, broken glass. And then uh, whatever this is called, I don't know what this is, maybe like web, but um, what you'd want to do is uh, go to File, New, and just make like a standard uh, standard document, 1280 by 720 and then you would just drag the image itself into the, into like the document. So you just have your black background and your, uh, just your whole image. Next you're going to go to file, save as, and then go PSD, and you can name it whatever, I'll name it tutorial. That's not tutorial, but uh, yeah. So, now that you have that, that's considered a displacement. Where is this? Ah, that's a displacement. So what you'd want to do with that is you'd go into your banner, and you'd just, rash, not rasterize, but you'd, you'd copy your PNG, and just open it by yourself, and you'd take it, and then you'd duplicate it. Now with that, oh, excuse my phone. But now with that duplicated a uh, layer, you're gonna go to filter, distort, and displace. You're gonna put the horizontal scale to three and vertical scale to five, stretch to fit, and then repeat your edge or pixels. And just click OK, and then you're just gonna scroll down until you can find out where, uh, like where your thing is. So mine's tutorial, but I spelled it wrong, and it says displacement file PSD. So you click OK, and as you see when you open it, it glitches out everything. Next thing you want to do is take an eraser and just erase parts that you don't want to be like all glitched out. And you can just like be creative with this. You don't need to do a certain way. I just click around everywhere. And uh, make sure with the text that you do, make sure it's still uh, still readable once you finish. Alright, so as you see, just like easy displacement if you can just like hide it and see the difference you can also use any other image you want so if you want to make another one you just open another document go back to the images you want or images that you want just take it drag it in and then go to file save as and just save the PSD to as put glass since it's a glass image click OK go back to your original thing duplicate the original layer which is control J go to filter distort and displace horizontal scale to 3 vertical scale to 5 stretch to fit repeat at edge pixels and then uh, just import it and they don't really have different really that noticeably different uh, kind of effects but this really helps with uh, making your banners stand out amongst others and it's very uh, very easy and very nice. So, I hope you guys enjoy this easy tutorial. It's been Bear, and if you have any tutorial suggestions, please leave in the comments. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoy the two uploads in one day. If not, then oh well, you can go screw yourself. But, uh, <laughs> hope you enjoy. Peace out.